drama. Some of y'all bummy, y'all need a little something. I got it. Ran through the retro. When them came out of one retro, done done it all jail like L.O. Now I'm in the track, got a booming like Metro. Let's do it. Shoe and beat. My day two at Sneaker Con in the A. I'm at the iconic Milk and Honey. So you know me, whenever I go places, you gotta find black businesses that thrive. Places to go and you can fly. Um, the app to even get your order is from the menu. So it's just cool. Um, I'm gonna eat and then I'll tell you how the food tastes, bro. Anyways, make sure y'all do me a favor, like, share, and subscribe to this video. I'll see y'all back at Sneaker Con. And I'm flying back home to my baby, y'all. It's been a good trip, good content. Had a great time to interview some minority businesses in this whole process. And make sure y'all help me get back to 100K. Stay blessed. Let's go. Microphone on, but shrimps and grits. With some hash browns, y'all already know, guys. I'm gonna make this plate look clean. Baby. Ain't nothing like some good stuff. We do this again. They too long, ain't too long. Ain't too crazy. I kind of came the back way. So, yeah, let's make it happen. Let's see what it do, what it do. Let's check out the line. It's just open, y'all. I'm back in it again. Was this, what, the third city this year? Cool. So, we to our techniques again. To the top, we go. The one, the man, the myth, the legend. What's going on, guys? My name's Dylan. I own realcapture.com. I have an online retail shop, pretty much. It's members only. And I also do a lot of whatnot selling, like my guy, MP over here. Awesome. So what got you in the, in the business, man? What what made you start? So, like, want to be a part school, of it? I was really into, like, spring stuff. I did it for, like, two to three years. It's, like, reselling on the side, like, on the weekends, like, after, you know, my, my day job, right? And then right. with that, kind of moved into shoes, like, freshman year in high school. It's been grinding a little bit. Graduated high school, and I've been doing, like, my full-time thing now. Um, While in school? Yes. Yeah, so that is school, crazy. Uh, for, for two years now, so it's been excellent. It's been a great opportunity. And I mean, one of my favorite things about doing this business is honestly just networking with people like you. Absolutely. Um, share stories, you know, communicating, and just kind of, you know, bridging the gap between retail and consumer. Absolutely. And I tell people all the time, there's enough money out there for all of us. Exactly. For real, for real. All right, man, I appreciate that, man. Great opportunity. My man, what's your name? Boss from Boss Kids. Boss, and nice to meet you, Boss Kids. So, man, what made you get into shoes, man? What, what, what it is? Man, uh, I always loved shoes. I always had heat. People always started asking me where you get your shoes from. Right. I was like, bro, just hit me up. I'll get them for you. Right. So, let me ask you, how many hours a day do you think you put in on your craft? I mean, 12 hours every day at least. Right. You know I mean? Right. There's no off days, and uh, it's a bunch of work. Think I ain't working, I'm, I'm still working. Constantly working. Hey man, I appreciate he got some heat, guys. Travis is a lot of good stuff, y'all. Make sure you take a look, man. Appreciate you, brother. Thank yeah, you so much. MD. What's your name? Marlisha. Marlisha, and what business do you run? Bank size. There you go, there you go. Size that is all. How long you been in the sneaker game? I've been in the game personally, most of my life. You know, I got into sneakers, uh, just really being a daddy's girl. Yes, ma'am. Something that me and my father did as I passed time going to the mall every Friday, every Thursday, you know, his payday. That's where right. we going to the mall, that's where we spent our time. Right. Probably about two years ago, I decided to turn my hobby into. How was the week that you put in? You think you put in? I mean, I probably, at least into my business, I probably put in at least about 10 hours a day. That's just doing general research, Bex. just looking at you know, releases, inventory, just looking at, you know, how can I better my business, be, you know, more cost efficient for customers. You know, the sneaker game, it's a lot of us out here. Yeah. It's a lot, it's of, a lot of money, too. It's, it's a lot, lot of out there. It's, it's enough for all of us. It's enough for all of us. Absolutely. It's 10 hours a day, easily. Right, right. Well, thank you. Cortez, man, how long you been in the business, big dog? Man, I've been in there since 2018. Thanks to my wife, she was like, listen, create, create, and make some money right. with the hobby that you got. She was like, since you lost shoes, hey, why not sell something? Yeah, yeah. From that point on, 2018, started with like five shoes. Now I came here and brought 130 pair of shoes. That's awesome. Let me ask you this, how many hours a week do you put in a week? Hey, it kind of varies, but if you think about it, man, it's a... All day kind of thing. So I would say in a week, I try to do 100 hours. Right. Well, I appreciate you, man. Love the store, man. Thank you so much.
What's your name? Sold out seat. Alright man, so tell me about man, like where y'all came from? Uh, we originally from a small town, North Carolina. Right. Right. How long, so let me ask you, how many hours a week you think you put in? I would say, it was probably about 70, 60 to 70 a week, depending on what's going on with you. Right, right. So anyone starting the business out, what word of advice would you tell them to how to be uh, stay faithful? Focused. Stay focused. Just I put on my family. I'm on legacy time like the Kennedys. We gon' be the newest Rockefeller, Panamera, same color marinara. Seats much room, portabella. Gotta run yeah, some mozzarella. Protect all the women and children with the armor on like an armadillo. I put the homies on payroll, came out the mud on the same road. If I see you bladin', we twinning, uh, how you gon' lose and I'm winning, uh, how I'ma be with the players at you in the seats with your nose drippin', we oversee with the clothes drippin', big on my dance, we won the Olympics, Jordan Seven Zone, them the Olympics, come together like the A-Rab, come together like the George do, we divide, steady, unified, kill for Gucci, they don't even fool with you, got a shift from the old way, need a beach for the team. Pick an island, you can pick a coast. But for the coach, will play a bigger role. I want to satisfy the end post, but the phone coops, not the end goal. Free the fellas with the small defenses. Probably bang rub, Gene Pro. I'll put you on, then it's on you. Play your hand, boy, bet it all. Never settle, girl, it's on you. Worst case, boy, you better buy. All this, all this, mm, all this, all this money. Yeah, all this, all this, mm, all this, all this money. I can't count it by myself. I can't bag it by myself. My whole clip getting rich. My whole clip whipping wigs. All this, all this, mm, all this, all this money. Yeah, all this, all this, mm, all this, all this money. I can't count it by myself. I can't bag it by myself. My whole clip getting rich. My whole clip whipping wigs. I put all the homies on payroll. A window open if a door closed. Show you how to generate wealth, bro. But is you willing to invest, though? We gotta see that the table. Matter of fact, homie, we.